Here's the commonality. You increase your testosterone, your prostate grows and gets bigger. The number one risk factor for prostate cancer, of course, is eight. The people that get old get prostate cancer. The mm -hmm. people that get old also get breast cancer, okay? Now, as you get older, you, your levels of hormones are coming down, not going up. So why are we getting cancer later? The first question is, what do the prostate do in your body? What is the action? What is the function of that prostate? Well, the prostate is supposed to be there to help you ejaculate, have the fluid to carry the sperm to where it's supposed to go. Now, here I am, when I'm young and I'm having sex, I wanna have sex, I wanna get somebody pregnant, I wanna reproduce. As I get older, that is not there. So now I have a warehouse, which is the prostate, right? Those cells change and become toxic because they don't have the testosterone that I needed to keep those guys busy so I can keep having sex. That's why most research in which involves sexual intercourse or having sex said that if you have sex less than three times a week, that would increase your, your risk of, breast, of uh, prostate cancer, which is absolutely true because you're not using it. It's an it's a organ that you don't use. It's going to change. It's going to become, it was going to come numb. Now with testosterone now, which by the way, it does increase PSA. Let me explain it. it. Increases the volume of the prostate. Remember now, I'm going to start having sex. So the warehouse opens up, the builders start working again. I get to produce ejaculate. I'm going to increase a little bit of size, but that is not permanent. It increases on size. Now it shrinks again a little bit, and then the prostate goes back to normal. So be aware. Yes, testosterone increases PSA. No, it doesn't increase cancer risk. It's a total, total lie.